He quakes me all in a waka. Hey, me tell a son in a waka. Me quakes a hole in a waka. Why do not sit set in a waka? See me now, let me know. Me mash up on a yo. Back on come on, come on, come on. Let me know. Babylon, they can call me now. To go with a come on, come on. They can go with a come on. Love, I'm in love. Love, I'm in love. Love, I'm in love. Yeah, love, you know. Fresh and come out. If not you, who is gonna, who is gonna love me? Who is gonna suck her down, suck her down? Baby, me, I beg you, please suck her down. Da -da -da, da -da -da. Can't let you go. Yeah, we have only by it, son. Can't done them already. <laughs> Straight. Greetings everybody, thank you for showing up today. I'm very humbled to be with you. First of all, I want to thank God for this opportunity because this is a dream come true. You understand? Because as you all know, I've, I've been doing this for a very long time, like from childhood and I've been coming to Mbarara back and forth. I recorded Tuvayo here in Mbarara. And um, I've been pushing music with a different cause, not just to do music for the sake of, of just dropping songs and things. We want to elevate each other, that's the, that's the whole point of doing this. And then on top of that, to live a youth, you have a future. You have a future, you have a running into from now and for so many years to come. So the whole idea of the Gantok Festival tour is to, how do we come together as one family? to tour our country, promote ourselves, and then get to promote our cultures in different aspects through using music, entertainment, dance and drama, plus film and, and all of that production. So that's why you see we're studying, we're studying right now, but we're gonna be doing this every year. And then hopefully we are, we are hoping like in the next years to come, I want to know about you and media to be able to be ready. We are connecting. We are trying to see that our generation is in touch. There is so much that's going on with our Ugandan industry, entertainment. I want to be able to do it. I want to be able to do it. But at the end of the day, that's not going to take us anywhere. And Africa, we survived 70% on talent. So we cannot waste time trying to create differences when we are all struggling in this world, trying to, to be in a better place. You understand? So the whole idea of the festival is to tour, work, have fun as youths, and then believe in ourselves because right now, we we cannot do this alone. Mabach making a happening and we're looking forward to keeping a good relation. The whole idea is to let's get in touch, like with the fans, with the media, with the other artists in different regions, with the DJs, with the promoters, with the influencers, because we are we are living under a digital era right now and things are pretty gonna change much better than they were before. So Chinochetuli Mukola to Mukwe we preparing us for no kulabanga we can elevate at the same time so thank you so much i'm waiting for your questions ready <laughs> music first of all it's gonna be interactions you see like how we're doing it right now it's gonna be more of that like let's get to know each other like presenter and artist dj and artist artist to artist presenter or influencer something like that so on saturday we have different activities that are also happening we're gonna have comedians we're gonna have artists and then we're gonna have also other different games like indoor games just for interaction because you cannot just sit down to talk without you know like something going on so this weekend it is basically ajip is is the home for all this that we want to do. Music, we have Apers, we have Benny Ganja on the same stage, so you can anticipate what kind of vibration from outer dancer we are going to put on stage. You understand? So 
it's a whole different vibration and then on top of that the type of music that we're doing is is kind of different because we are spreading the gospel not just for now but for the good of the whole industry we are looking at are we able to do music that is able to beat the test of time <laughs> like timeless music so these are the things that we're going to be interacting all talking about with different artists or yeah so the whole vibe is about let's get in whatever whatever vibe cultures we own that yeah this is what i want to tell my my brothers in the industry you know a collab is is friendship it is not just singing together so many times people have done collabs where they don't even perform so me as a, a a growing artist from back then i've seen the impact of of creating friendship rather than just jump to a collaboration so that's the reason why we are trying to put that gap like the link in between the different artists are we trying to all be in our visions like at the same time because you see the music that we're doing is not just being done today to be here only for today it's gonna be around for a very long time so what do we all to do as artists we all to be friends we all to be business partners and how do we be business partners so if i do a song tomorrow with truth 256 that simply mean we are elevating the festival and the next year the next time we come through we're going to be adding more artists but there is need for that connection first like live alone Hey, Truth, I want you to come and perform for me on my show. Hey, bro, I'll do it. You get it? There is that extra conversation that you have to get in. Okay, where are we pushing this? Because we are one family. It's not just artists, artists, no. We are family pushing for the same thing. That's why you see, when I'm doing a show, my brothers will come. When they're doing a show, same way I'll come. And we are serving the same people. So that means if we sit down and plan properly, that's that's the thing I want to introduce in this. If we sit down and create friendship and we know, okay, we're going to be friends and we have the same dreams. So let us push here. If I do a song with truth, I know the reason why. And I know where we are pushing. So that's why we are here to interact, to make sure all these things happen in real life. Try to do the collaborations, but meaningful ones. You understand? Not just for the hype of... Because you see... The industry you're talking about in Kampala and all of that, you're seeing already what's happening. It's too much of, of, pretense. of pretense. It's too much of fights. It's too much of, of I want to be the best. I'm the best. I'm the best. And then at the end of the day, the people who are flexing to be the best are just killing space for the talented ones because the real ones cannot shout. And the fake ones are the ones who are making noise. You understand? So at the end of the day, what do we do if we can't come together as the youth artists, build our own thing, find a way of penetrating through this industry without having to abuse your next artist to be something? Because to me, it don't make no sense. This is supposed to be one family. It is supposed to be realness. So we're trying to break that fakeness because you see people do a collab and then the next thing, the other refuse to give me a video. He refused to come for a video shoot. We did this and this, and then he was like, that song is too, you know, for me. So that fakeness is supposed to go away. And the only way we can do it is by being real. Like, bro, you know what? This needs to be like this. Because it is business at the end of the day. Yeah. <clears throat> Bring the event to life with our live streaming services. From parties, workshops, conferences, a Yidi TV will make sure your audience gets a memorable experience.